this is always like a, a, I guess, an argument or a conversation. If power is God given or if it can be cultivated. And, and I don't know if you have an opinion on that. Like, can a guy come in and say, you know, I don't have very good power. Can you cultivate that? Or can you make me stronger? Um, being so there's a difference between having knockout power and just explosive power. So it's a rare case where a person has technically both. Mm -hmm. So you got people who are naturally strong that can put you out with one or two shots, the one hitter quitters. Mm -hmm. You know what Mm -hmm. I mean? But then you got other guys who are actually really strong and they can break you down throughout the course of a fight and then actually get the knockout. You know what I mean? So Mm -hmm. I think that's something that's uh, that you you you're you're not you can't just develop knockout power out of nowhere, you know what I mean? It, it just doesn't happen that way. So what happens is four more. So what happens is um, you know a person can train their movements to where you're generating power by twisting the torso, stepping into the shots working on your tricep muscles, shoulders, chest, anything along those lines can help out with enough impact. But now we're talking about if you have just enough force and you could develop the speed, then you're running into a situation where you can use the opponent's uh, momentum and then score a knockout and not even try. Hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So it's kind of like, like, you know, Floyd, Floyd Mayweather is, is a perfect example to be used because – He's he's fast and he's strong, but he got a nice pop to his punches. But if you get hit with 17, 18 of those same shots in the same spot, he's going to break you down. Right. But then if you got a guy like Tank Davis who hits you one time on the right spot, you know, you're you're going you're going out. So it all depends, man. I mean, to answer your question, I don't think you can develop knockout power, but you can definitely develop enough strength that'll help benefit everything else that's adjacent to it. Now, if you were a fighter, you know, if you were a pro fighter and you had one or the other, is there something that you would prefer? Would you prefer that one hitter quitter power or would you prefer, you know, the ability to get me wrong? What I'm going to say is, is always going to be one of those type of arguing or debating type of responses, Mm -hmm. but Mm -hmm. having knockout power is also fantastic because you know, you're just that strong. You become very feared and, and no one wants to get hit with something too crazy. You know, I don't care who it is. No one likes to get punched. It's, it's just not something that we're OK with, even as a fighter. So, like, even though you're you're OK with knowing you're going to get punched, no one's OK with getting punched. Mm-hmm. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. So for me, if it was up to me, I go with skill over power because you got more fighters in the past and statistically that will get hit with lucky shots and they get, they get hit what we call on the butt and then they go to sleep. You know what I mean? But they were either winning the fight or they were losing the fight, but it happens. Now, if you're dealing with someone who is incredibly skilled with every aspect of the game, then I'd rather choose the skilled fighter because it just shows the caliber of level of IQ that you are in that ring. So if you beat a person unanimously and it it made it just look that much easy, then it just shows you don't need to be on the same level and or even share the same ring. It's an honor to share the same ring, but it's not, it's like, you can't really compete with me. You know what I mean? And I'd rather show you that way rather than going for a one hitter quitter. And then it's like, all right, now the next fight happens. They're not, that's not happening the same way. Now it goes the distance. You know what I mean? So I'd rather, I'd rather be the guy to, to go for uh, the 